What is up? I'm back. I'm playing Into the Dungeon today. So, Into the Dungeon is a deck builder roguelike. I was given a key from the developer, and I do really appreciate that. I guess there is multiplayer. Uh, I did not really. I'm gonna go with the Paladin. Try it out. Start the run. Tree of Ember, Into the Dungeon, Merchant. So, it's kind of like how uh vault of the void is that you can actually build your deck how you want to build it i guess looks like uh click a card to upgrade it or remove it so yeah all right so i don't really want to do much in the beginning of a run i get 150 when i first start a run i can buy an artifact one of these artifacts if I want. Or I can buy one of these cards. Or remove stuff. For 50 gold. How much is it to upgrade? It's 50 gold. Alright. So I heal 5. Gain 1 mana. Exhaust. Ally. Hmm. Okay. Sharpen of combat. Gain one sharpen at the start of combat. What's sharpen? Uh, it would be nice if you had the... If you rolled over like a status effect like sharpen. If it actually told you what sharpen does. That's also a tip. Uh, I guess it could be over here. No. Hmm. Yeah, let's just say tip. Or having like an icon right here that actually has like, oh, sharpen does this. Uh, and then all like the tip, just a tip bar, like sharpen and whatever, like other status effects. Because I don't know what sharpen does right now. So I would just probably buy this and wonder what it does until I actually figure it out. Uh, or it might tell me what it is when I'm actually playing it more. Uh, like, if I buy it, uh, it still says one sharpen. Gain one sharpen at the start of round. I don't exactly know what sharpen does, but I'm hoping that it's going to be good. Um, this is a cool little map. Similar to Slay the Spire, you're going through, it's a pretty simple little map. It's uh, probably randomly generated. Pretty sure it is procedural generated. And then this one is doing six damage. And it's going to hit me for six, so that sucks. How much health do I have? I have 60. Okay, and this unit intends to make you weaker. Okay, that sucks. Uh, okay. So I kind of want to kill this one first. All right. You like damage and gain one smite. So this one does tell you what smite does. That would be nice if the actual like sharpen told me what it does. Unless uh, outside of actually this. Now I can see what it does by hovering over. But it should be like hover over the text too. That'd be nice. Uh, sharpen deal one damage per stack. Sharpen doesn't fall off at the end of the round. That's pretty good. So I just do one more damage. Smite. Uh, gain one smite. Deal seven bonus damage on your next attack. So. Next attack of that enemy? Or just next attack? Huh. Let's try it. Fudge. Alright, 
Well, it was next attack of that enemy. Great. I took six damage. Oh, no, it's seven added to your next attack. Oh, interesting. I should have read that correctly. That would have made more sense. Uh, gain seven block, add two fragile to all enemies. Seven block. I do block everything if I do that, but I don't really need to do that. You can just kill it. Boom, victory. We did take some damage, but whatever. Doesn't matter too much. Uh, gain two smite. Seven bonus damage on your next attack. So how does three smite do? Would that be every three attacks that you do have seven smite? That's what I would think it would be doing but it not might just do all seven seven times three probably does what i just said the first time not the second time it does every single time you hit for seven add three strike cards that cost zero mana to your hand sounds cool Gain seven block if, uh, draw one if the last card you played was holy. Okay. Or I could just take money. You know what? I'm just going to take money. Screw it. All right. So now we kind of want to focus on that one first. And the best play would probably be blocking. And then we can attack. So we attack that one. We'll also attack this one. We block everything, so we should be fine. All right, my controller just disconnected, which I don't really care. This game kind of is low. I should maybe up it. It is like max volume right now. I could up it a little bit more, but it's not necessary. Alright, what I should have done is did this on this one, and then that I would have killed both at the same time. Eh, doesn't matter. I kill it next time anyways. I don't really care. Boom. Victory. It's giving me like little stars and stuff. It's kind of like super auto pets. Giving me stars. Interesting. What does that stars mean? Uh, gain 12 block, gain three resistance. Okay. Gain seven holy. Uh, draw one if the last card that you played was holy. Right. So if I want to do a holy deck, that does sound pretty cool. Deal seven damage, deal and deal and additional two for each. That should be and not and. But yeah, deal an additional two damage for every defense card in your hand. Okay. That's just a typo. Um, 
steal seven damage. Hmm. I do like the sounds of this one, Divine Ward. That's a lot of damage. I'm gonna grab that. I'm gonna do a holy deck, I guess. Even though I did skip it the first time. Ooh, this one's like an elite one. This one does a frick ton of damage. Alright. Let's go block some. And I hit it. This one intends to heal its ally or give it damage to its ally. That's even worse. Dang. I don't know what to do. Deal bonus damage on your next attack equal to stack? Oh my god. Alright. Eight. And then we can do another seven. So seven, eight. Uh, I'm not going to kill this. Of course not. But... If I blocked, I would only block 15. I would take 6 damage. I guess blocking is the best play here. This is too much damage to take. Alright. Nice. Oh, this one is gonna use a poison on me? Oh, shoot. Alright. Uh, that sucks. Alright, I'm gonna do this. To find ward. And then this. I'm gonna try to kill this next turn. Ooh, deal 10 and increase damage per stack of might. Oh my god. Eighteen. Oh shoot. I can only do 18 damage. That's not enough. Burn. Card can only be played once. Huh. Burn. What did that just do? Guess we'll just do this. I'm going to take a hit anyways. I need to take the least amount of hit that I can possibly do. I went from almost full health to half health in this fight. Definitely, definitely did that. Alright, we're going to do that. That. And do this. And block all the damage. Nice. Nice. Alright. We're going to take a hit. And sadly, we're taking poison damage too on top of that. Wow. That is great. That is a great freaking fight. <laughs> Gain 100 gold upon pickup.
gain one block when you draw a card on your turn. I guess I'm going to gain a hundred gold. Gain one smite for every attack card in your hand. Hmm. I'm just going to get gold. There has to be like a shop coming up or something. It's a 79 health. It's a frick ton of health. Here, I'm going to go like this. Hit you. And I have smite now. So my next attack is going to hit you for 7 more. Mad. Some... Tea to you or fragile, whatever. Nice. All right, deal seven damage and two additional for every defense card in your hand. How many defense cards do I have in, have in my hand? I can't even see what. No, I can see what's in my hand. I do have pretty good defense cards in my hand. This is not currently doing anything. So we just attack it this turn. Damage received increased by 10% per stack. Nice. Alright, how much damage am I really doing? Eight damage? Yeah, I should be able to kill it then. Boom. There we go. I updated the game, right? Well, now I did if, if I didn't. Alright, so I think we're going to go with gain seven block. If you... As a holy one, heal seven, gain two resistance. That's also a defense, but we're healing. Let's go with that one. That one's cool. That one counts as a defense and heals me. Let's go heal. Can I need health? All right. So I'm going to take gold from this chest. Alright, is this like an elite enemy? Oh, yep. 100%. Another elite enemy that we just fought. Is there not many variety to enemies in this game? Feels very samey so far. It's always a problem, but sometimes games, they can feel samey, which sucks. I really want to kill this one. This one does a ton of freaking damage. All right, fragile. Then we're just going to hit it. Come on. Seven. Alright. I should have a lot of blocks in my hand, so that should be fine. Alright. Err. Whatever. We get it next time. Heal seven. And then I'm going to go attack this. Can I get that card again? Or does it like 
Go away. No, I can't. I can get it again. No, it is exhausted. Yeah, that's exhausted. I can't get it again. So there's no exhausted deck, but it, it says it's exhausted. So I can't draw it again. It's not currently in my draw pile. That sucks. All right, whatever. It doesn't matter. Burn. Got to burn the enemy. Oh no. Um, just block for five. Dang. There we go. 32. That does a frick ton of damage. That does a lot of damage. Gain 15 at the end of every combat. 15 gold? You know what? Why not? Heal 5. Gain 1 mana. Exhaust. Alright. I, I kind of want to get that. That sounds cool. And I kind of want to heal. So what's really the gold spent for? Like, is it just for removing cards? So this is like a first boss fight now. What does this do? Every time this unit does damage to health, it gains one sharpen. Oh, that's a freaking amazing ability. Yeah, that's super great for me. You know? This unit enrages when it reaches 50% health. Oh, this is going to be an awesome fight. So, 7 plus 2. Alright, I can... Heal. Alright. And then now let's go do this and this. So can I block everything right now? Seven, five, there we go. It's doing no damage to me. How did it get sharpened? Oh, whenever it does damp, it's going to do damage. Uh, this unit does damage to health, it gains one sharpen. No, it didn't do damage to my health, though. It's just about to. It's freaking sucky. That's why I blocked everything. It also is going to heal. Oh, that's freaking amazing. I love that. How much does it heal for? 10? That's fine. Alright, it's gonna gain some sharpen because I can't really do much about that. I could, but then I can't do all my damage. I really want to do damage. Dang it. Alright. So now... I guess we'll do this. This. And this. Half health now. Some smite. And do that. 
fragile, not smite. I don't know why I keep on saying smite. Fragile. Enemies about to enrage. Oh, great. It's about to do 14 damage to me. I was fucking... Oh my god. I'm about to curse. I did curse. Sorry about that. That's freaking amazing. Alright. Uh, this enemy tends to weaken you. That's good. <laughs> Alright. 81. Uh, only doing 7 damage. That's not bad. Alright, let's go do this and this then. Alright, now that's doing 14 damage. That's pretty bad, but still, I'm gonna do this and this. Because that was a big hitter. That was a big hitter. Right there. Ah, shoot. Get these out of my hand. Good thing that those are zero cost, but still, they are a waste of part to be played. I do not want to play those. Alright. Well, great. I'm taking 20. Oh, shoot. Oh my god, I'm almost dead. It has four and I have four. Screw you. I'm gonna kill you before you kill me. Victory. Let's go. And... Upon taking lethal damage breaks this artifact and returns to 50% health. It's pretty cool. So we get like a revive. So this is kind of like that one in Slay the Spire. It's pretty cool. Uh, gain one extra mana every round. Start combat with five exposed. I don't know what exposed does. So I'm just going to go with this one. Uh, smite. Average. No, that's Avenger. Hmm. I'm going to do Holy. Power, gain one block for every card in your draw pile. Yeah, screw it. Let's go with that one. Oh, shoot. That's what the gold is for. You can spend the gold between. I didn't buy anything. I was stupid. I just... Oh, shoot. I just went into the run without spending any gold. Whatever. This unit intends to increase allies' defense. That's freaking amazing. This one has sharpen. This one has a poison. Next attack, poise, poison equals to a stack. That sucks. That really, really sucks. There we go. Killed that. Get out of here. No, I take six damage. But I do have this. And then I can do hmm. I can play all of these, but what order should I play them? 
Should I try hit both of these? Gain block equal to the number of stacks at the start of round, just not to fall off at the end. Alright. I only need to do 13 more damage. Alright, two more damage. Wow. Alright, so I'm only taking one damage. I can do this and gain some tube resistance, so... Uh, reduce incoming damage by 5%. So, right, that would be... I don't take any damage. I do take one damage. Alright, whatever, screw it. Doesn't matter. I want to kill this little tick thing. Let's kill it. There we go. Killed it. I just need to get more defense cards. And holy defense cards would be even better. Alright. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. That was my big hitter. My card. It's very samey, this game. These enemies feel the same. They're the same fight that I just had. Is it the same order that they're... Yeah, this is the exact same order. They're trying to hit me in. Okay, well, that's great. But my Carter order is different. It's even better. Alright, 11 block. I am locking most of it. But not all of it. Alright, I can do this. Do this. And we can do this. I want to get rid of this poison one. Dang it. I'm going to take damage. Take one damage at least. I'm gonna take seven damage. Well, I'm gonna take eight damage because poison. Whatever. Killed that one. Yeah, yeah. Alright, heal up some. And then do that. And... Hmm. Deal 10% reduced damage. Ooh, nice. Alright, which one do I want to kill? This one deals more damage to me. I don't want to kill that one. Ah, shoot. I'm not killing it. Yep, that's extremely bad. So now I'm at 40 health. Ah, great. I have one more of those, right? Can heal up a little bit more. This took two, I did two damage. <laughs> That's freaking amazing. Oh yeah. Alright. Whoa. 
Don't kill it. I need to get my thing out. You get the healing out. Where the heck is the healing? Exhausted. Oh no, I exhausted it. Okay, I only had one of those. I had two of the other one. Alright, so I guess we'll just do this. Victory. Even though I took damage in that fight. Defense cards cost one less attack. Oh no, I'm just gonna go with this one. If I get to the next shop, ooh, you can buy tons of stuff in the next shop. I like the play style that, like, you can remove a bunch of stuff in between. It's pretty cool. I think I'd be better off if I didn't skip the shop. The second shop. Oh, I should have played that card. The attack card. Oh, whatever. Can't do anything about that now. Just say that I wish I did that. Which I do. I can't do anything about that now. Alright, I guess I'm gonna go with this one. I'm gonna get, try to kill that one first. Because that's the least amount of health. Oh! These things are actually applying sharpen. Oh no, this one's buffing them. Yeah, I really need to kill that one. Definitely. Alright. I'm back at full health. Yeah, I wish I didn't misplay in the beginning. Yeah, I needed to do that. Or I was going to take some damage. Be a lot of damage, and I didn't want to do that. I only took one damage. I'm gonna kill this one. Guess we're doing that. Try to avoid taking some hits. I still took hits. Great. Oh my god. How is that full health? Oh my god. Whatever. We killed it. Uh, stone wall. Gain 10 block. Gain 1. 
draw. Draw one if the last card you played was holy. Okay, that's interesting. Let's go with that. Alright, I guess I'm gonna go with this. Get those two campfires. Summon an ally. Freaking amazing. Uh, when this unit dies, give all other allies two fortify. Uh, yeah. Sounds awesome. Even those those defenses didn't do anything. Whatever. Come on. I just need to kill this one. This fight might kill me. Whoa, 22? Freaking kidding me? I don't know if I can block that. Can't really do much about that. Dude, and then this one is just summoning more enemies. Oh, they suicide. After a while. Alright, whatever. This sucks, this fight. What the heck? I don't even have it anywhere close to being dead. This fight sucks. Oh my god. Maybe I should have targeted the mummies. Now I know. But still, I have to kill this one too. Like, I have to kill the one summoning them. And it has so freaking much of health. I don't have much damage. I don't have that type of damage. Kill that. I think I'm just dead here. I don't have that type of damage. Man. Alright, come on. I'm about to die. Yeah, I'm about to die. This is the lowest I've ever been in this game so far. It's just, I can't kill this. And then it heals, it heals too on top of freaking summoning. Oh my god. It freaking heals. Vanquished. First impressions of this game so far, I, I like it. It's not super easy, but it is like, it's cool. And each character you can start out with whatever relic you want to start out with. I chose the Paladin, which gave me reduced income damage. 
but if you want to like do this one, the Viking, upon taking lethal hit, you uh, get revived. It was a cool game so far, and I definitely will play it again in the future. Uh, I'm going to record a video at right after this for it. If you do want to pick up the game for yourself, there's a link in the description below. It is a cool roguelike deck builder. Uh, it does feel very samey. There's not a lot of variety to the enemies that you're facing. Pretty much every fight is going to be the same. Uh, I would like to see more variety. Maybe it's going to happen in the future. I think this game is in early access. It is in early access, so it's going to probably change that in the future to become less samey. And then it will become actually like a really cool uh, fleshed out roguelike. And yeah, it's, so far it's, it's very cool. Uh, I, I like it. I like the premise that you can buy shops between rounds and stuff uh, after fighting a boss or and when you first start. Thanks for watching. See you in the next video. All right, later.